Well, hello, good morning, and uh, welcome to an episode of uh, Camilla and I. And uh, here today, we're at Keyhaven, one of my favourite seaside resorts. And uh, had an absolute bit of luck this morning. Shh! There's a whole flock of black-tailed godwits just close to the path here. So uh, it's marvellous. Quick, before they all go, before they all disappear. Quick. So literally, just off the path here, to the right of me. Well, left as you look, I suppose. I oh, know, right of me. Yeah. Just off to the right of me, you can see this flock of uh, black-tailed godwits. I judged it perfectly this morning. The tide is going out. The flock of black-tailed godwits are not unduly alarmed, and because we're here early this morning, there's not so many people along this path. So we're doing really well. So yeah, what a bit of luck. Can't believe it. So it's not all luck. I have seen them here before, to be honest. And uh, I was hoping this morning that they would actually be here. But this is the largest flock I've seen so close to the path. So it's been absolutely marvellous. So what are we getting on Camara and I? So we've even had a curlew in and amongst the flock as well. So uh, yeah, link to a bit of uh, curlew footage just in the channel as well. Absolutely beautiful, lovely bird. But uh, predominantly out there is the black-tailed godwit. And uh, what a wonderful subject. I mean, oh, marvellous birds. I've got a few shots of them here in the past. Link to a few shots of them here in the past. Absolutely gorgeous. So absolute marvellous footage on the uh, black-tailed godwit this morning on Camilla and I. Enough to make a whole video, I should think, separately on the uh, black-tailed godwit. So uh, black-tailed godwit video coming. Absolutely lovely. Loving it. So as the tide recedes, they're moving on to the mudflats now. So I've sort of done the reflection shots, and now we're on to uh, mudflat shots. Beautiful. So pretty spectacular here on uh, Camilla and I this morning. Black-tailed godwits. They're often here at Keyhaven, so well worth a visit. But uh, yeah, absolutely brilliant to get them this close. This close to Camilla and I, absolutely superb. Well, now we've got a curlew in our sights. Amazing. There it is. What a beautiful bird. So close. Link to a video I made on curlew earlier. Wonderful bird. 
one of our largest wading birds. So I did a whole video set to Beethoven on the curly. <laughs> you want to see that? Beethoven. Oh, I thought it was appropriate. What a beautiful bird. God, we're blessed this morning. Could have slightly better light. That's my only complaint. But absolutely superb. Usual bird settings. One five hundredth of a second perch bird. F9 on this because we're still on the 200 to 600 with the 1.4 teleconverter on it. Just for reach. Seem to need it this morning. Absolutely amazing. And if anything takes off, takes flight, we've got the 1 1600th of a second F9 auto ISO. So uh, hopefully get some flight shots if they take off. Anyway, incredible. We've also got some little waders joined the party now. These are either done then or not. I always get tied up in knots. But it's one or the other. Beautiful little wader. Again, you never get this close. Absolutely superb. Brilliant stuff. See how close we are. That's how close we are. Absolutely incredible. They've got used to me now, so. Ooh, we had a flight there. Quick. Well, beautiful footage on uh, Komodo and I this morning. Absolutely gorgeous. Well, now a little flock of Dunlin have decided to join me. Absolutely incredible. Beautiful. So, what do you photograph? Spoilt for choice on Camilla and I this morning. Blacktail Godwits. Or a flock of Dunlin. Absolutely incredible. He's out there, Tom. <laughs> well, I've just had uh, one local lady come along and uh, say that uh, this is the best she's ever known it in this channel. And um, certainly I'll vouch for that. That's the best I've ever seen it in this channel. Absolutely incredible. Take a look at that now. Still, a whole flock of Dunlin. Absolutely incredible. Lovely sight. Just worth it for the spectacle alone. So close, just off the path. I hope if you come to Keyhaven you get as lucky. This has been absolutely marvellous this morning. Overcast, making photography great. Ooh. Well the blacktail godwits have gone to sleep, so it looks like it's the Dunlin. Yeah, so this is the scene on Camilla and I this morning. Absolutely fantastic. It doesn't get much better. So this is the spot on Camilla and I. Really hard work. You've got a park bench now to work off. Oh, we do take it easy on this channel. Well, I'm just eyeing up a future video on uh, Camilla and I. Uh, one to look out for. It's uh, going to be on uh, reflections. Um, so uh, just checking out the uh, top lagoon, Key Haven, for uh, reflection shots. I have a few. I know they're regrets. But uh, anyway, yeah, remember to uh, subscribe 
because uh, I'm doing a specific photographic episode on how I get my reflection shots. So normally these birds are, are disturbed eventually by the sheer number of joggers and walkers that ply this path, but uh, today we have been truly blessed and they've stuck around for ages. We've now got um, Dunlin I think as well, we've had Turnstone, we've had uh, Curlew, we've even had a um, little egret do a little walk by, linked to a little egret doing a little walk by. Absolutely incredible, lovely sight. Don't mind me at all being here. They just seem to think I'm part of the furniture. Must be the new jacket. Anyway, blended in a treat. Mind I probably should have worn my fluorescent jacket. Like the time I photographed the Kestrel. Ooh, linked to Kestrel. Amazing. Anyway, what a location. I mean, look at this. Just the location alone well worth while being here. Absolutely gorgeous. Overcast conditions. Great for reflections. Absolutely beautiful this morning. Anyway, don't forget, like and subscribe. Um, let us know in the comments how many birds I've identified wrong. And um, yeah, look forward to seeing you in the next one. Have a good one. Bye. From Keyhaven, Camilla and I out. Before the path gets too busy. I can hear some feet now. Okay. <laughs>